if you've been paying attention to the news at all lately, you may have noticed that there's an increase in animosity and hostility between different groups, not just in this country, but all over the world. I believe that we can overcome this if we can learn of and gain respect for people of different cultures. We all live in this world together. I figured what better way to connect with another culture than to learn their language. I'd always heard that Japanese was a difficult language to learn, but when I tried to learn it, I found it quite easy. So I figured I'd dedicate this video to showing you how I learned it, and you can learn it just as easily. How I learned to speak Japanese was to watch Japanese movies with English subtitles. But you're going to need a wide variety of movie genres, a little bit of everything. You need some westerns, some sci-fi horror, action documentary, educational history, romance, musical, and maybe even some monster movies in there for good measure. But you want a good variety. Okay, now you heard the Japanese there. He said, Niko, Godzilla is coming. Now, when we translate that to English, it's, look out, Godzilla is coming. Now, if you listen extremely carefully, you might detect some very slight similarities between the two languages. But I'd understand if you missed that, because it's very, very subtle. The main thing to understand is that Japanese is faster and more intense than English. Now, once you've got this phrase down, Niko, Godzilla is coming, um, you can adapt it to other things, such as, Look out! Matra is coming! Or, look out! Gehidra is coming! So it's very flexible. You can use it in a lot of different situations. As you might expect, those phrases are very commonly spoken in Japan, especially in Tokyo. If you're planning on visiting Japan, you definitely need to know those phrases. But what about somebody who's coming from Japan over to America to visit us? Uh, King Kong is dead as far as I know. I saw him fall off a building. I saw it on the news. Uh, but you can greet somebody from like, Japan by saying, The goat, Trump is coming! Or, The goat, Hillary is coming! Because no matter where you go in the world, there are monstrous threats. And the answer to that, I think, is pretty obvious, really. If we can see this. Yeah, there you go. Now, believe it or not, there's still more to learn regarding the Japanese language. But it would take me almost another five minutes to explain the rest. So practice what we've just learned now. Make sure you fully absorb that. Um, I don't want to overload you by giving you too big of a chunk all at once, so we'll do the rest later. I think just now we've made huge progress in healing the world through greater tolerance and understanding and respect for people who are different than we are. I think we may have just solved the world's problems. Sayonara.